Welcome to Gamer Mom Plays Witcher on Hard Mode. Greetings, Ansem. You look a tinge fatigued. Wait, didn't you rescue that child at the gate? Yep. By chance. By chance? Really? If only the local peasants chance to do good once in a while. Oh, no matter. Aw, okay. look at the little heart behind her. Beer. I'll bring it in a minute. You're quite a talker. Forgive me. Your beauty rendered me speechless. Oh, but you know how to compliment a woman, Ansem. <laughs> that's funny. Alright, so that's what I do when I have this cheaty shopkeeper. She's cheaty because she how buys stuff for full price. <laughs> so really, she's just sort of like holding things for me. <laughs> Oh, and I just wanted to point out that I, I got a mod that increased stack sizes, but I didn't like how many it limited you to, so that's why I have this one that lets you have... Oh, iron and steel. That lets you stack these things. Isn't that cool? You just have to go in and change the file. Just really easily. You just open it in text and then resave it as the default file. I've already read it, okay. And then there you go! You can stack crap as high as you want. Super awesome. Cheating is my favorite. Alrighty, shopkeeper. Oh, also. How can if you want her to go away, you just ya. say, see ya. And then she walks off and eventually disappears or stands by the door like a weird person. Hmm. Three ounces of Optimum Martyr, a drop of Mercury Solution. Uh, oh, sorry, I got lost in thought. Greetings. Greetings. I'm Cogstein, alchemist. Geralt, witcher. What? A witcher? How much would you ask for an opportunity to examine your body? Ew. I don't think you could afford it. You would be doing a great service to science. Uh-huh. All right, fine. Though I perceived you as someone who valued reliable knowledge. <laughs> I respect science and scientists, alchemists too. And I guess I expect the same in return. I see. Well, hmm. Maybe you can agree to a post-mortem then. Keep talking and I might change my mind. Regarding alchemists, that is. All right, all right. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, come on. Let him examine your body, Witcher. Wink, wink. He looks like a monkey. They say you need ghoul blood. Do you have any? I'll come back when I've gathered some. I need that blood for my studies. Be quick about it. Hey, you should be grateful, not be a douchebag. Right, Ruben? What? You don't look like a local. You look like I a live monkey. In Zima, but I'm just returning from a great convention of alchemists, pyromancers, and geomancers in Oxenfort. Wonderful city, which are a cradle of science. I don't doubt it. Did the convention reach any specific conclusions? It was an incredible experience. I presented my dissertation on... Specific? Conventions aren't meant to be specific. Then I'm not sure I see the sense. Science is like a great river, full of currents, whirls, and treacherous shallows. A single raftsman can never know every secret of the river. He must sail to the harbor and share his knowledge with other raftsmen. And get drunk and spend his last money on whores. I think I see the point now. Hmm. Science is like a river. Uh, sorry, I got lost in thought. You were talking so about weird. returning to Vizima. Ah, uh, yes. Because of this quarantine, I'm losing time in this inn. I have extremely important research waiting. And what am I doing sitting in this dump and drinking alcohol? Badly distilled alcohol. I've sent a message to my friend, another alchemist. He is my only hope. Hopefully he will send me a pass. Hmm. Well, I wish you luck. Thank you. They must admit me. They must. Do you ask everyone for permission to examine or dissect them? Of course not. But you're a mutant. A scientifically <laughs> wrought improvement. Something unnatural. That explains it. 
Don't take offense. I'm merely curious. Mm-hmm. Need any help from a witcher? I do. Check the notice I hung outside. I did. I wanted to ask you about alchemy. I did. Finally, someone worth talking to. Here I thought the locals had no interests beyond their daily concerns. Not a local. I'm not exactly a local. And think about it. If the locals were all interested in alchemy, they wouldn't have much need for you. Ha! Huh. Typically short-sighted. Witcher, alchemy is the mother of all sciences. And do you know why? For it allows us to understand the world. All that surrounds you is none other than the alchemy you strive so dutifully to deride. No, I don't Alchemical deride it. Alchemical processes transpire in your body at all times. They allow you to eat, breathe, and excrete. Ew. What's more, they are responsible for your thoughts and feelings. Alchemy is life. We need to change the subject before the peasants decide to burn us at the stake. <laughs> One cannot shut the mouth of science. But fine. What do you wish to know? Hmm. I'm interested in formulae. Ready-made formulae are rare and difficult to acquire, so I encourage you to experiment, modify recipes you already have. Most people underestimate the value of using the empirical method in science. I don't like experimenting. I think I've but we've only just begun. Farewell. Um, so that's why I put in a mod that is cheaty, cheaty, cheaty. Cheers. You saved me, right? Right. I helped. I wonder what will happen to me now. Waiting for your kin to come? No. My family has passed on. Sorry, kid. It's all right. I barely knew them. That poor little kid, he needs new clothes. Did you want to ask me something? It's been a long time since I've heard mention of Salamandra. Do you know anything about them? I think they're a group of bandits who terrify the locals. Yesterday, they returned a boy they'd whipped with a lamia. A lamia? A mayhem crop with small barbs and hooks. It rips away skin and flesh with each strike. Most civilized countries have banned them. The boy was delirious. Muttered something about a ransom and the reverend. Sadly, he grew feverish, and he died that night. Thanks. I may stay longer than I planned. Why the interest in Salamandra? They killed someone I was fond of, and stole something of mine. I wouldn't want to be them. Do we know each other? It's me, Shani. Don't you recognize me? Whatever happened to you? I heard you died during a massacre in Rivia. Unfortunately, I lost my memory. I recall the last few weeks, nothing more. The kid's scratching his butt. I'm afraid I can't help. Medicine's a fledgling science here in the North. I can say that your memory might come back on its own. It's not that bad. I'm actually getting used to it. I hate to admit it, but sorcerers are somewhat more effective at this than we are. Maybe one of them could help. What brings you to this village? I'm traveling to St. Libiota's Hospital in Vizima to help fight the Catriona Plague. When are you leaving? Once I've helped the victims of the dog attacks, I guess. I can't abandon them. It'll delay me, but some are certain to die without my aid. So what'll become of Alvin? I don't know. I'll look after him for now. Maybe a villager will take him in. He seems clever enough. Surely someone will want him. Did you want to ask me something? We'll speak later. Bye! Time to go fist fight. Oh, hold on. Yoink! 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 No challengers! Wanna. Yeah, I do wanna fight. You can up the bet. I think you can double the bet, but they won't take more than that. Oh, kick your ass and make money doing it. Oh, Let's my see. word. I'm not making fun of Down Syndrome people at all, I promise. But that guy looks like he has Down Syndrome. What the heck? Whoever made that character mo Maybe they were trying to make him look like that. I don't know. I like people with Down Syndrome. At least the ones I've met, anyway. They've all been... They've all been nice. But I know, not everyone's nice. 
I just love how they I just love how they're childlike. Shoot nuggets. Ouch. Look at how fake that blood is. No challengers. You fight like a lass. Oh, I'm itching to save somebody. Who wants to get slapped? <laughs> the board is so fake. Who wants to get slapped? That's funny. Stop saying who wants to get slapped. This takes so freaking long. You win, Wanderer. Take your coin and leave me be. Leave me be. Alrighty. No challengers. Wimpy one. Wanna fight? Got any money? Cha. No pain, no gain. We'll see. Okay, so I just installed something that a mod that's supposed to help with textures, sounds, and um, blood spatter. So. Oh, smash your face! Oh, I guess it doesn't spatter all the time, huh? I hope it didn't wreck it. But I can always delete it. Who wants to get slapped? Ah, ooh. <laughs> Jeez, Witcher, go easy on him. You don't gotta knock him out cold once he's down. Leave him alone. He's like, I'm ash. And that guy's like, I am unimpressed. <laughs> the guy with the muscles on that tattoo. Lost again. Should have known. Here's your goal. Why do you keep fighting, man, if you suck? It's not a good idea. Okay. No oh. challengers. Who wants to get slapped? I'm trying to fight you, but obviously you're worse. So. Who wants to get slapped? I'm itching to hit someone. Whoa, you guys have the same voice. Who wants to get slapped? No challengers. Fighting. Huh. Wanna be? Yeah. I'll so, kick your ass and we'll see. do I get 40 then? Because he puts in 20 and I put in 20. Hit me, chicky! Ouchies. Good thing I'm dodging so much. Dang, he hits for 19 and I only hit for 10. Or 8. Or 6. Dang, 15. Dang. Uppercut, nice. Shoot. Nice. Alright, we got it. I think this part goes on for way too freaking long. Every time. It's like, okay. <laughs> you win, Wanderer. Take your coin and leave me be. Yeah, I think I will. Who wants to get slapped? Okay. Whoa! Some tournament going on? We beat each other for coin. Interesting. That guy's the biggest belt Fat ever. Fred will rearrange your face. Just show me your gold. How much? 25 orans. Can I bet more? I'm in. I want to bet more. Jeez, that's so freaking lame. I ducked. Or I tried to duck. 
I'm going to kill you, you bastard. No, you're not. That's not nice. He wants to either. get slapped. Quit dodging me, man. Are you going to dodge everything I do? You probably are going to win. I'm going to kill then. you, you bastard. Butthead. He wants to get slapped. Duck, bro! No challenges. I keep telling him to duck and he doesn't. He's so annoying. He wants to get slapped. You bastard. He's not freaking hitting him. Dang, Fat Fred. You're not playing around. Dude, stop standing up when I don't want you to. I am pushing the duck right now. See? And he's not freaking ducking. Duck, stay ducked, stupid head. Why are you so stupid? We're never gonna beat him at this rate. Is there a way to like say no, thank you? Is there a way to say like left click to select? What does that mean? Oh, well, I'm already equipped with my fist. I'm good, so. He wants to get slapped. Stop! He's killing you, bro. I should have taken something to heal too. I would kind of not be fair. But they don't make anything about it. Gosh! Fighting or watching? Oh my gosh, she's gonna beat me. Dang, I got him on the defensive though. He can't even like. Hit me, this is weird. There we go. Quit dodging all of these. Jeez. Man, if he didn't dodge so much, I would have killed him by now. He wants to get slapped. Dodging butt face. When I hit him, it makes a sound, but he doesn't take any damage. Stop dodging. Butt face. He wants to get slapped. Stop saying that. You guys are so annoying. I wish there was a way to like say this is a draw. Like you can exit in the gambling games. I'm like, no, help me. Can I leave? Ooh. Sweet. Maybe that does it? Maybe that helps me withdraw from it? Yeah, man. I need to be taking that crap. And eat me some food. So I probably lost my money. That's cool, though. I just wanted to freaking give up. I think I need to, like, go Nanai. Oh, wait. Let's go Nanai out here because it's free. Scary sounds. Oh, hello. Greetings. Greetings. What a despicable place. I'm trapped here with my goods while my wife and children wait in the city. Why is that? Vizima's gates are closed due to the plague. The gods be my witness, nothing ruins trade like an epidemic. I guess we just have to wait. Most of the diseased have died off, but the beast and bandits now spread their own terror. All we're missing are tax collectors. <laughs> Can I ask you something? Yes? What's with this plague? What of it? Tis some variety of the bubonic? To be safe, I avoid any who appear even slightly ill. 
Aren't you afraid? I'm immune to infectious diseases. My grandfather claimed the same, insisting all the while that his bubonic ulcers were merely boils. May huh. the ground lie lightly upon him. Yes? Tell me about the beast. I overheard it described as a phantom, appearing from nowhere, murdering those with a heavy conscience. Interesting. <laughs> Royal officials would make a true feast for the beast, and other ghosts serve it, apparently in the form of untiring bloodhounds. I'll have to ask the locals. Yes? Any bandits in the outskirts? Indeed. They call themselves the militia and extort bribes. Hmm. Also, some sect from Vizima may have arrived here. Do these men wear the salamander sign? Never met them. But if they are a sect, the Reverend ought to know something. I'll ask him. Why does yes? the Reverend know everything? I dislike it here. The beast is struck again. No. Wow, you look super old. Damn those bloodhounds. They're called bar guests. No bar Army lot. Azima's gates are closed. Yeah, I know. Okay, so not all my herbs are unknown. I do have a mod that lets me learn all the herbs, but I have to have the herb guy come. The eternal fire protects no sinners. Repent. One never knows when the beast will appear. Monsters abound in the crypt. Well, you guys all are like identical triplets. One just side, because you just never know, and you're so always should side. <laughs> right, how many levels have I gained? <laughs> Two. Well, as always, this is important. So now I can get stuff from monsters, and now I can make oils for my blade. And, okay, whatever. Dexterity, I want to be able to attack and dodge better. And deflect arrows, that would be good. What is this? Harry. What is this strength? Nice. Okay. Um, I don't have any things that really... Hey, I can make that. Nice. Damn, I'm thirsty. <laughs> Of the things that they say. Okay, thirsty man. Alrighty. So I actually meant to uh, meditate until dawn. I don't want to be going out when it's. Oh, it's only four hours. That's not bad. I don't want to be going out in the dark because there's like scary, scary monsters. Plus, there might be more people in the tavern when it's later in the day. Silver doper. Hey, drunkard. What? Always gives. It's all the same. The beast will have us all. I'm glad we talked. Let's celebrate. Farewell. Why are you glad we talked, man? So I always try to keep beer and food on him. How? See ya. Go away. Let's see if she disappears. She just sort of walks. Who's this? Where do you go, lady? Where do you go? Okay, I'm bored. I want to go check inside to see if um there are more people in there now that it's morning. I don't know if they maybe come later because it's what like oh it's 8 a.m. Okay. Who do we got? Who do we got? Oh yes, this guy. I'm forced to sell my goods out here. <laughs> Bad luck. I can't enter the city either. Want to buy something? Rob me in broad daylight. Go ahead. <laughs> what are you peddling? My life. This guy. <laughs> what the frick? So these are the cheat ones, right? Um. So I'm just gonna buy them for way cheap. And let's see. I'm gonna buy the history books. But not the ones that give me plants and monsters, because I already know all those. 
fairy tales and story tales. I like these though because it gives you um, journal entries to read, and I like to read those sometimes. Okie day, okie day. Then this is what I do. I just go like this. Boop, 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 boop. Oh, too many boops. Boop. Boop. So then when you go over it, it tells you you've already read this. I love that. Alright, so I need to... Oh, I need to summon that lady again and sell her all of these books. So, cheaty, because I just got my money right back. Okay, but here's the deal with this lady. I just want to tell you up front, if you use this mod, she has like a maximum amount of items that she can carry. And usually by act two or three, she's full. So, what I suggest is using the cheaty... <laughs> Sorry. Cheaty shopkeeper. Okay, so then you get a bunch of money. And then I recommend using my mod to increase your amount you can bet and make a ton of money um, and then just buy stuff back from her and throw it on the ground because I mean with my mod you could make money super easily it depends on what version you use but you can use the cheaty one <gasps> where you basically win every time unless you have really bad luck <sighs> Damn squirrels. Oh! you don't look like one to be lucky at love but I wager your luck excels at dice. I know a bit about the game. Yeah, I want to play. So, I wouldn't cheat you. An honest game's what I propose. Honest? Why choose me? No one else is willing to sit down with you. <laughs> Risk is your daily bread, that's clear. I'd consider it an honor to play you. My pouch is as empty as a smith's bellows. The peasants round here have nothing but cabbage to wager. A hunter, a worthy opponent, used to fancy a game. But I haven't seen him in a while. I'm not surprised. I don't doubt you fleeced him. To be frank, he loved high stakes. Yet the dice disliked him from the outset. Hmm. Who is this hunter you played? Must have been quite a lover, for I've never seen such ill luck on a man. He lost a lot of orans. Hmm. Watch out. Love wanes. He'll be back for his gold. I think not, sir. You could smell the loser in him a mile off. Aww. The debts must be keeping him away. It's unkind. Can you make a good living at dice? That depends entirely on who one plays, sir. The wages are certainly larger in Vizima. And where in Vizima would I find someone willing to play? If your money pouch is bursting, try the new Naracourt. You might also choose the hairy bear. If you have the nerve. If you have the nerve. Farewell. So once you get dice, you can play him. Um, Alright. I'm not gonna try to beat that guy yet. Oops. I love how she just stands at the door. Uh, can someone get this to open? Because I don't know how to work it. Doopy doopy doop doop. Ah, uh, this guy. Look at this drunkard. <laughs> it cracks me up. All right, so now I'm gonna go out here. Army life's tough. I love when they say that because no one in the army would ever say that. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's just so funny. All right, I was just sort of going around collecting herbs. Now, um, there's no reason to go into this house yet because the guy won't tell you anything until you've met with the reverend. So we need to go here. And our map now has a red pointer on it. Yay! Tells us where to go. Okay, I'm always going to pause it when I'm picking a bunch of herbs because I know that's probably boring to watch. So I just pause the recording and do that. So this is creepy. Ew, are these people that croaked from the... Ew, get out of here, it's all infected. The plague! The plague! Let's go find some more dead bodies. Ew. Um, I thought there was something to loot in here. Guess not. Just dead people. That's gross. What is gross? Hello. Greetings, witcher. I'm the local hunter. Hi, hunter. Wonder how I know you? No? So be it. <laughs> what do you want? 
Okay. I'm looking for witch's work. Since you're here, a monster supposedly haunts the lake shore, devouring peasants late getting home. Eek. A ghoul may have made its lair in the crypt. Eek. How much for each? You witches do nothing disinterestedly. Kill a monster, bring me proof, and I'll reward you generously. Did the peasants say anything more about the lakeshore monster? Just that it hunts by the lake at night and kills people. What does the creature from the crypt look like? Perhaps a standard ghoul, but who knows? See for yourself. How much do you collect for a drowner? It's my professional secret. Come on, we're in the same profession. It seems so. So, how much for a drowner? Depends, but on average, 80 orins. Dang. I've never come close to that. I knew something was wrong with those prices. Calm down. Progress wherever you look. Only witchers, the relics they are, still work for a pittance, while being called freaks by those they do favors for. Right. A fair day's wage for a fair day's work. What was that? Nothing, nothing. Dickhead. Take care. People are so prejudiced against witchers. So here's the question. They are humans who have been mutated. Are they still human? Or are they are they actually some fantastical type of I don't know being? I don't know what is happening. Hold on here. Okay. Door. Hello. Sweet. Something for... Ew. Half-eaten corpse. Well, let me just rummage through your body and take your belongings. Ick. <laughs> whoa, whoa, those children are going fast. <laughs> Kill my uncle. He's evil. Oh, well, who's your uncle? You sort of look like... Weird. Stupid game. Hey. Why You're going so fast. The mod I have? Blood. Ew. The mod I have makes them go faster too. I realize that I'm going not towards the dude's house, but I want to come down here and find stuff. Oh yes, that's where the cave is. Got it. Well, I guess I should go rummage. Ew. Through that guy's nastiness. I guess that item stacking isn't working anymore? Oh, that's weird. Was it like a, a game file I overrid? Can you not stack things anymore? Oh no, she can. That's weird. And I don't know why, but there's always weirdness with bottled water. Sometimes it stacks and sometimes it doesn't. Oh, here, let me tell her to go away. How can I don't want her just See hanging around with that weirdo corpse. Look at how pretty the mod has made this place. Oh, here's a place of power. Medallion. Detect nearby monsters. Uh, okay, but I don't see it. So then, I have 100% signs. Swallow, one hour left. So this one, okay, interesting. I'm not going to go in the cave just yet because I'll get my butt kicked, but I mostly came down here for the herbs. So yeah. Just so pretty, especially for old timey. Uh, this is the mod though that's retextured everything. Well, my father's sword is bigger. <laughs> uh, let's not go there. Yeah. So I entered the village region. Don't get killed. White hair one bearing weapons on your back. Okay, hold on here. Greetings, handsome traveler. First kind words I've heard around here. I like travelers. One showered me with flowers. Alright, here's some tulips. 
Last I got tulips, my beloved called me the most beautiful. You find me fetching. What do you say? <sighs> a nook somewhere. He's gonna hook up. I think. He... Okay, porn cards. This is the main reason I say this game is inappropriate for children. Um, just because even if you don't have the sound on, you're listening through headphones, there's still those nude... Whoa! Today, Abigail sells an ointment for boils. Ick. Delightful. I My cow needs no Oh. Well. Sorry. Abigail sells an ointment Oh, gross. You are the one I already talked to. Who's in here? Hello. Abigail sells an ointment for Dude! Boils. Delightful. I, hope I guess nobody says anything different. What a day! What a day! I love how nobody minds him just coming in their house and taking all their stuff. I mean, some random guy walks in your house and starts going through your stuff, and nobody seems to care. They say abandoned houses became monsters' lairs. Huh? Oh, that hoarding witch has an eye on me. Do you call her a whoring witch? That's a kind. Oh, look at those little shoes. They look uncomfortable. Hello. My cow needs milky. Nice. Oh, that whoring witch has an eye on me. Uh, you wish. Uh -huh. Guys will convince themselves of anything, huh? All right, everything's freaking locked. Oh, that hoarding witch has her eye on me. Nobody has her eye on you. Don't get my cow needs milking. Everyone's cow. I don't see any cows around here, people. Abigail sells an ointment for boils. Quite the oh my, delightful. Abigail sells an ointment. Sometimes I just wonder if they will say something different. That's why I'm clicking on them. Because I think, and you never know who's going to give you a quest either. Thought you were a bandit. Oh, that hoarding witch has an eye on me. What a day! Well, people were just walking in your house probably are bandits. It's not real safe, is it? I'm just gonna go through your barrels and just, you know, just take some of your crap, so... Stinks. Well, don't poop there, then. Where's the Ooh, witch's gosh. hut? Oh. Oh no, that's the witch. No, that's not the witch, that's that dude. Where's the witch's house? I thought it- maybe it's up here. No. Why can't I remember? I thought it was down here. Okay, so we're coming to the city. And I am gonna wrap it up here. Thanks for watching this episode. Next, next time we're gonna go and meet the villagers and the reverent and all of that so thanks for watching comment like subscribe bye